When something gets to you, it bothers you. It causes anxiety. It causes stress. Sometimes it results in fear. When something gets to you. This is different from get to as used for be able to or when you travel or go someplace or when you do something. Working late at night gets to some people. Here's the situation, working late at night. This could be replaced with it. It gets to some people. And of course, this could be replaced with an object pronoun. Gets to me. Working late at night gets to me. Gets to him. Gets to her. In the present tense, it gets to me. In the past tense, it got to me. If you want to emphasize that something is causing you trouble or panic or fear, then add really. It really gets to me. It really got to me. Knowing that people are being killed in war really gets to me. This is the situation here. All of this you could replace with just it or this. It really gets to me or this entire situation. This is starting to get to and then here's the object pronoun. Get to me, get to her, get to him, get to them. This is starting to get to me. This is starting to get to her. This is starting to get to them. So it's causing trouble. It's causing some sort of anxiety or stress or feelings of unease. Don't let this get to you. Don't let this bother you. You could replace get to with bother. His job is getting to him. This is the situation. In some cases when this sort of thing happens, a person leaves the situation and that would be the job. If your job is getting to you, then perhaps you should leave it. My, my job is getting to me. You, your job is getting to you. Make sure that the possessive adjective pronoun matches the object pronoun. 